Hey guys, welcome back. This is just a quick video today because I know I had a few issues trying to do this early on and I had to do a bit of digging online and Facebook to work out how to do this. So I'm just going to show you how to connect to the OBD2 plug on a Japanese delivered V35 Skyline. Not sure if it's the same for G35 in America. But um, I'm in Australia and I'm going to show you how I got it to work on my car. So as far as I'm aware and I could work out online, this is the only OBD2 connector um, that will work with the protocol, which is I think J185. Mentions on there. This was $70 from JCar in Australia. And the unit looks like this. So it just plugs into your OBD port. So this is on JCar's website. I'll put a link to this in the description. So you can see it's $70. And then down here, specifically says J1850. So this is the protocol that you need to connect to. And it currently doesn't work with iOS devices. So you'll need an Android with the latest version to connect to this. On Skyline, it's just underneath here. It just pops down like that. And you can plug it in. You can just tuck this in and leave it on there the whole time if you want. So now you've got your OBD2 plug. The other part you need is Nissan Data Scan. So this is just the $100 Lenovo tablet I got from Harvey Norman. So when you're on the App Store, there is quite a few... You just need to search NDS2, Nissan, Nissan Data Scan 2, and you've got your paid version. Um, I would just get the light version first and see if that will connect if you've got the right plug. And then you need to go ahead and pay for the $10 one if you want to actually drive around. Because after one or two minutes of being connected, it will actually just drop out on you. So now you've got it open, you need to put your car into accessory so just key the car on and then connect and select the one you've got now it's connected you can see the it's just scanning across then it gives you some information about your car so then we just swipe across um, this is just displaying information You can check for your faults here. You can relearn for your math if you're doing like an upgraded math on your car. And then here you can see um, the accelerator's going as I'm pressing it. So just start the car now. the free version you only get about 30 seconds or a minute before this all shuts off it is a bit slow you can also use this for logging information one thing I didn't show you on there is that before you connect you will need to scan for the device and add it in uh, mine I've already used it before and that will work yeah so just to recap Japanese delivered V35 Skyline you need to make sure you get the right plug these eBay um, connectors that are like 10 15 20 dollars they will not work. I've tried two different ones and they do not work. If you're still having if you still have an issue with that connector and you can't download any of the files, 
I've also gone to Super Cheap Auto and they charge you about $25. Their tablet that they connect into the car can read the codes no issue. They'll print you out a sheet with all the codes on it and they can even get you the parts as well so it makes it even easier.